Hey everyone, it's Clary here, and today I'll be explaining the differences between shared and dedicated IPs. Firstly, shared IPs are cost effective. Shared IPs are cheaper because the server shares the IP address with other game servers. You're assigned to limited specific ports to use for your server. This is the ideal and practical choice for budget conscious gamers. Another point is connection. Players might have a harder time finding your server since it shares an address. Servers that have shared IPs require an IP and port combo to connect to your game servers. Host names can still be used to connect to your server if the IP and port combo is too long for you and your friends. There are some limitations to shared IPs. You're only able to run one service at a time due to limited ports. Now onto dedicated IPs. Dedicated IPs are ease of use. You're able to use a wide range of ports. This allows you to use different games default configurations such as Minecraft's 25565 port, Bedrock's 19132 port, Terraria's 7777 port, and many more. This would mean that you can directly connect to your server's IP address. A bonus to having a dedicated IP is you can have multiple services. More ports mean more services in your VPS. This is of course in consideration to the memory allocated per service in the VPS. Another pro to dedicated IPs is you have full control. You have more control over server configuration and security measures. This allows for customization like installing mods. The installation of certain plugins and mods becomes easier when you have a dedicated IP. This is especially seen when you have plugins and mods like Geyser, Simple Voice Chat and Denmap. This means that they work with little to no configuration due to the availability of all the ports for your server. In conclusion, shared IPs are cheaper, but have limitations on the number of concurrent services. It also has limitations on the ease of connection. On the other hand, dedicated IPs offer better control and more freedom, however, they do cost a little extra. If you're interested in purchasing a dedicated IP with us, there are two ways you can do this. The first way is by adding the dedicated IP whilst purchasing a server with us. As you can see here, when creating a server, if you select the hosting option, you're able to select dedicated IP instead of shared IP. Another way to get a dedicated IP is by upgrading to a gaming plan. If you have an already existing server, all you have to do is head to its dashboard and scroll down to the change plan option. There you can select either the dedicated IP add-on if you're on a hosting plan or upgrade to a gaming plan. The main reason why players should consider getting a gaming plan is due to getting the dedicated IP, more server locations so you're closer to your actual area, and better hardware for your gaming needs. I hope this video helped you understand some differences between a shared IP and dedicated IP. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask us in the comments or contact our support. Thank you so much for watching!